pack button. Oh, hello, Craig. Uh, this must be your mother, Mrs. Smith. Please, do come in. I must say, it is a surprise to see you in school, Craig, after being off for the last two weeks. Well, that is what we're here to talk to you about, Mr. Patrick. I know he has this cold, but the computing exam is coming up very soon, and I really need to see your son coming in and making an effort for it. Sorry, cold? Yes, that's what was stated in the email. I don't know about an email, but my son was off due to an ingrown hair in his arse. <laughs> his arse? <laughs> I'm sorry, Mr. Patrick, but is there something about my son's arse that you find funny? Oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm so sorry. But, I mean, I don't see how this could affect the outcome of your son's exam. Look at this face! That is the face of a boy who is in pain and is clearly incapable of taking this exam. He's sitting down all right to me. I think he's fully capable of coming in and taking the exam. He is sitting in pain and disbelief that his teacher will not believe in him or his mother. He has an operation on the day of the exam and he will be attending. Mrs. Smith, this is quite absurd. I think your son should come in and take the exam and reschedule the operation. My son's arse is not your playground, sir. You're not the governor of where it is and where it is not. Please, for his education, I assure you your son will be safe in our hands. The own the hands. I'm entrusting my son's arse with his aim at the NHS and no one else. I'm sorry, Mrs. Smith, but if I let one go today, there will be five arses tomorrow. I mean, how will this end for Craig? Well, my son's arse safe from the likes of you, sir. At the end of the day, Mrs. Smith, this is you and your son's decision alone. But I think you're making a big mistake. You are not paid to think. You are paid to educate. And I think both of us deserve an apology for your behaviour. You, you, you're always embarrassing me, Mum. I mean, it's just, he can't solve my eye. He's my favourite teacher. He's the least. He tries to help. I wish we never came here. Mr. Patrick's okay if I use your printer? Sure. And if I ever have to come back in here and talk to you about my son's ass again, you'll be sorry. It's not what it looks like. 